Hey everybody, this week I am in San Antonio, Texas, and yes, I am sweating because it's hot outside, also because I got done with my workout and an idea came into my head of what's been going on for the last few months that I want to share with you around my physical body and my mental state. So, for the longest time, I've been struggling with my body image and my weight and how I look and how I feel. And I've done every type of workout you can think of, P90X, uh, private trainers, all those things. And I've always searched for something when it comes to how I want to look. And until recently, literally recently, I've really been figuring out it's not about how I want to look, it's about how I want to feel. And I know people know this, I know some of us know this logically. However, when I let go of this feeling of here are the type of arms that I want, here's the type of abs that I want, um, I'm not the most attractive person in the world, I'm not the fittest person in the world, but my body can do all the things that I want it to do, thankfully. I know there are some people who have different abilities and different things that are, you know, whether it's awarded to them or given to them or by luck or whatever it is. And I'm sharing this video with you because this concept that's really changed my mind and it's the difference instead of looking at goals around our body or our mental state of how we want to look, going more around how we want to feel. How do we want to feel with our body? How do we want to feel in our mind that I know that there are things that are biological or there are things that obviously are hormonal. However, one thing, a couple things that I've done is when's the last time, when's the last time you looked in the mirror and talk nice to yourself. I know that sounds crazy, but I was talking to a few people and I hadn't. So I'm asking you not in the sense of like, when's the last time you did it? I want you to think about it. And maybe if you have, that's great. If you haven't, take time when you get out of the shower or when you see it, when you see yourself and, and say some nice things to yourself. I say that because I'm doing that now and I'm feeling a lot better. I am feeling like I'm more attractive. I'm feeling like I'm more fit. And you know what? I am, I've lost 16 pounds. I am toning up and it's no longer about the way that I look, it's about the way that I feel. And I wanna do this because I, I really do believe there's a lot of people who struggle with this, myself included. So this week, uh, take a couple times to look at yourself and smile and say thank you and give thanks to whatever abilities that you have. Instead of thinking of the things that you don't have or like you wish you had, start, let's start there and say thank you. Thank you to being able to breathe or being able to see or being able to have skin that, you know, you feel good in. Whatever it is, your hair, it doesn't, it, it doesn't matter. It, what matters is how you feel about it. And if we start labeling and when we start labeling those good things, that's when we can do a better job of saying, okay, what can I control? Well, I can control that instead of eating four pieces of pizza, I can eat two pieces of pizza and a salad. I used to eat half a pizza and I'm like, why am I so, why am I so unhappy with my body? Uh, and what else can I do? I can wake up and I can give gratitude. I can do all these things that I can control and there are some things that I can't. Let go of the things we can't control, focus on the things we can while giving gratitude and start talking to ourselves nicer in the way of how we want to feel, not how we want to look. And that's when things change. That's when things change for us. So I wanted to share that with you. I hope you all are having the best week. I'm about to jump in the pool because it's literally 106 degrees here. I'm, I'm so I'm so sweaty. And I hope you all have the best rest of your week. I'll talk to you in the next video. Bye, y'all.